to get on his ass. Yeah, two thirds. Like See, a lot of people think. Grab another man's sword. That's the same thing like grabbing another man's like hey, most prized possession. That's some prized possession, man. Right? We care about our, our sword. You feel me? Like this is you. You make it to your liking. You don't just have nobody come up and touch you. Okay, hey, but that's my no, fault though, yo. Oh, no, you good. No, we ain't even talking about you, man. Just other dude. Just came up here. If you got a question, let me know, man. I, I might be able to edify you. Okay. And wake you up and like yeah. This is Luke 24 and 44. And he said unto them, These are the words which I spake unto you while I was yet with you. All things must be fulfilled written in the law of Moses. All things must be fulfilled, which was written in the law of Moses. So we go uh, get into the topic of how most people like to say that the laws are done in a way with, and that's not true. Everything is still much in full effect, and that's why we in the trials and tribulation and the poverty that we're in right now, because we don't keep them laws, such as eating pork. Right now, I just left the house. I wanted to speak on it, and it kind of vexed my spirit to see my family about to make some fucking pork neck bones. <laughs> I, 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 you know me, I mean, I don't mind. I mean, I'm old enough. I'm able to provide for myself. Yeah. The water you have about shimmy out shop, like a thought. But sometimes I like to come home to a meal, too. I mean, I'm still under my right. family's right. head, right. Uh, household, if you will. Right, I want to eat, Just too. saying, yeah. Yeah, I want to eat, uh, But just saying, though, like, I, and then I, you try to tell them the love, but they don't want to give ear yeah. to it. Yeah. Or they say, I'm still going to do this. So they kind of market themselves. You hate to see them go, but they got to do what they got to do. I mean, that was their life. So, I mean, yeah, you love your family, but... Family's not always right, they wicked. But um that I just wanted them to get that out how um everything it he said which were written in the law of Moses. So even then and today is still in full effect. You wanna have a new speaker up since you're about to switch camera? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Todd can get it. If you got a scripture, let me know. I might jump in off the spirit. Yeah, yeah, he about to make me switch the whole <laughs> the whole thing up. Ishmael gotta go. Ishmael gotta go. It just made me think Ishmael be listening to that fucking music at the store. Like, you ever go to the corner store that, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It should be funny, man. Like, um, yeah, whenever, uh, when I was, like, delivering food and all that, like, I usually, like, listen to, like, the college radio station. Like, first there's, like, um, like an Ephraimite program. Uh. But then at six for, like, um, two hours, there's just, like, Oh, okay. It's like, I don't, I don't know, I'm pretty, like, open-minded when it comes to music, but I, don't, I just don't, I don't know, it's something about it, I don't like yeah, it. Yeah, man, it's just sounds demonic, man. It's good up. If you got something for me to open up with, I think I'm out. Okay. I'm the shit out of me, man. Yeah, like, no. I take that, I take that person, just because, like, I mark mine the way how I know it. If he was to grab my shit and rip my page off, and this is, like, a $30, $40 book, like, you can't just... Get this, get another. It could be anything going. I could be down and out right now, but I still got my sword. You take that from me. It's, it's a wrap, man. Yeah, I'm gonna spaz out. Yeah, man. Most, I, I, Brothers, too, like, you know, like, that's their, one of their most prized possessions of anything. He said, knowledge and wisdom shall be the stability of that time. The knowledge and wisdom is seeking the Lord's face, which is in the word. Like, how you doing, man? It's, it's in the word, so you can't. That's like almost not taking it from you. Cause, I mean, you could go get another one, but at the same time, that's like your possession, you know? Uh, you're, so just, you're just touching the yeah. it with your... Like, bring your own sword. If you want to debate, debate, but don't... don't you're just a fucking nigga, man. Only a yeah. fucking nigga yeah. would just yeah. walk yeah. up. Yeah. And yeah. He didn't like even that. ask. Like, he just... Yeah, he, he just, just grabbed And truthfully, I thought he was going to steal, because that's how... I, I, I ain't going to lie. Um, when I used to work at the old job at a retail spot, people would do that shit. They'd make a, a false a false type of topic of discussion. Like, one dude, he had, he had come in with a big-ass trench coat. He'd, tough, he'd stuff his whole coat and shit, and then he'd act like he on the phone. And he was like, all right, my, this, he's like, my business ain't everybody's business, and walk out the door. He'd act like he's standing outside and have this conversation come back in, but he'd never come back in to buy shit. So he just walked out with a coat full of shit, but the other shit, he'd walk up to the counter where he just leave because he didn't want to buy it. Yeah, but just saying in general, nigga, it's man. those type of saying devices that I know I can record, I, I comprehend shit. Like he'll he'll, he'll go try to hustle off the Lord's word. I ain't trying oh, to cut okay. you off, but he'll try to take that and go hustle off the Lord's word just because yeah. it look nice. He got the gold pages. He got the uh, he got the tabs already on it. Yeah, you ain't got to put the tabs on it. Oh, he ain't grabbed that one. Just, yeah, he ain't grabbed that one. Just grabbed saying in general, though. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. A, he could go and try to hustle off the Lord's name. I might have really, a right cross. Did they hear this? Oh, it's I ain't going to cut you off. First Peter 4 and 15. But let none of you suffer as a murderer or as a thief or as an evildoer, or as a busybody in other, other men's matters. Uh, or even, come on man, fucking thou shalt not steal. 
Yeah. Right. Uh, that's simple. That's simple. Yeah. That's simple. <laughs> On the tablet. If you don't simple know this truth, you know that commandment. Yeah. Because that's, that's, truthfully, not to catch you off yeah, or to nigga. take from you, but that's the laws of the land. And that's what these Edomites go by. They call themselves sovereign citizens, yeah. meaning they don't have, they don't have a social security number. I don't think they have a birth certificate. They just claim to be, uh, they, they live, but they don't live. Literally. They live off the grid, if you know what I mean. Right. So they go off what they call the laws of the land. And they got like 10 laws. They damn near the same as the uh, 10 commandments, if you will. But basically, thou shalt not steal, thou shalt not murder. If you don't touch me, I don't touch you. That's basically what they go off of. Yeah. But I mean, everybody knows it's common sense. You don't just come up and touch. I thought he about to touch a sign. Like, That's what I thought. Take a sign. Too. He actually picked up the Bible, though. Yeah, I think <laughs> it's, it's a passage. I think they stole the stole something. They, they, when they touched it, everybody died. The ark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ark. The ark of the uh, covenant. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna get that in the yeah, script. Yeah. yeah, it's too pure. If you touch it, it's too pure. Huh. And if you want to clean, you touch it. Show ass, man. Goddamn nigga, man. I could, man. Niggas do that. Niggas would touch something that's too careful. Yeah. And, and, and that would have been spiritual. You know, what if you would have touched and that was the, something like the art or something like that? And you touch it. I'm about to get that right now. And you get an L and, and you die. It's too pure. It's 1 Chronicles 13 and 9. Yeah, 1 Chronicles 13 and 9. But that's speak about Uzzah, if I, if I said it right, Uzzah, Uzzah, Uzzah. Um, basically, yeah, and they teach, they all. Uh, I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let the scripture bring it out. Go ahead. Yeah, the first time I heard that story, I was in uh, Sunday school. Uh, like, of all places. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he said, of all places. <laughs> this verse, Chronicles 13, chapter 13, verse 9. And when they came into the threshing floor of Chidon, Uzzah put forth his hand to hold the ark for the X stump stumbled, huh. and the anger of the Lord was kindled against Uzzah, and he smote him because he put his hand to the ark, and there he died before Yahweh. No, no, huh. I break that down. Yeah, he said, he said it stumbled. It, 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 no, you got you break. It All down. right, well he said it, he said it stumbled, so he went to catch it. So picture like, uh, you know, uh, it, it might, I don't know if y'all ever seen the movie, but um, I don't know why I like making verses with movies. Um, yeah, it's um. The uh, Ocean Eleven, Ocean Eleven through Ocean Thirteen. If you know they had like this little golden uh, uh, egg with like diamonds yeah. or shit on it, and it was like really expensive. You know how they sit it up on them little altars or whatever, like a little podium almost. Yeah. They sit the egg up on there, and they got like a light on it. Everybody get to take a picture of the egg or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But it, it stumbled. So picture something like that, like it stumbled, like you thought it was about to fall, so you reach forth to catch it. Come. But because he was impure and he went forth to touch the ark. Lord, he got put to death. Smote his ass. Exactly. Yeah. The Lord could have had it to where yeah. he calmed the land and it actually eased out and it stood still back up. Yeah. But he went and he was doing the righteous thing. He didn't, he wasn't, I mean, he, he went off, but he was doing, he, he, was, he thought he was doing yeah, something thought, right. And that yeah. was spoken of, I think, uh, yeah. Proverbs as well, where he's talking Proverbs or Psalms. He said, that, uh, it is. Look, your thoughts, like your a, thoughts on that, my thoughts. No, 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 I'm about to get it. I'm about to get it because I feel like I'm going. We got to keep going. I'm going to finish this. I'm going to finish this out because, and David. Okay, so basically, ooh, so so God got mad about that, man. You can't do that. You can't touch something that's too perfect. And David was displeased because the Lord had made had made a breach upon Uzzah. Wherefore, that place is called Perez Uzzah to this day. You might gotta look that word up. And word. David was afraid of Yahweh that 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 day, saying. How shall I bring the ark? How shall I bring the ark of God home to me? So David brought not the ark home to himself to the city of David, but carried it aside in the house of Obedium and God at that time. And the ark of God remained with the family of Obedium, if I'm even saying right, in the house in the house three months. And the Lord blessed the house of Obedium and all that he had so yeah, really like so got the, got the root word eat him in it yeah eat him in but so um, yeah basically you know you touch your something 